So for the first step, we're going to head over to search and type in CMD. Then we're going to run it as administrator and then click on yes. Once on this, we're going to type in SFC space forward slash scan now and click on enter. Then you want to run the scan. We can run it in the background as to do the next steps in this video. For the next step, on your web browser where you're having a problem, you want to click on the three dots in the top right and then click on settings. Then in the bottom left, you should have something that says about Microsoft Edge or about Chrome, etc. You want to click on that and you want to make sure the web browser is fully up to date. Next, you want to clear the browsing data of the browser that you're using. So head over to Privacy Search and Services. It might be different depending on the web browser that you're using. Then click on Clear Browsing Data and now choose what to clear. Then you want to make the time range all time. And you want to make sure that cookies and other site data and cached images is selected. And then you want to click on Clear Now. For the next step, you want to click on the three dots on the top right and then click on Extensions. Then click on Manage Extensions. You want to remove any weird or spammy extensions that you think may be causing the problem. It will give you the option to remove it. Next, we're going to head back over to search again and type in CMD. Then we're going to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. Once on this, we're going to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS and click on enter. Then we're going to type in netsh space winsock space reset and click on enter again. Now you want to restart your computer and the problem should be fixed. 